What is up everybody, MSGD back with some more Road to Interstellar gameplay here on Modern Warfare 3. We have 503,000 of the 1.2 million XP we need to get the magma camo, so that's going to be a little bit. It's going to take us some time, unfortunately. Um, we do have Hardcore Hardpoint, which is great. We're currently leveling up the AMR9 as far as the Interstellar camo goes. Um, we need four more levels to get the AMR, AMR9 fully leveled. Um, the last one is, I think, like 15 kills with somebody affected by your tactical. So we'll go ahead and change the tactical to, uh, like, stuns or flashes or something in a moment. Um, once we get to level, like, 27 or 28 with the AMR9. So that way, once we get to level 29, we're just right away. Um, but for now, we're using decoys, which don't actually help, so... Or, they don't help with the, um, affected by your tactical. I guess that would be too easy. But they are helpful when it comes to getting XP, so... And all that matters is XP. A lot of the camo is just, can you get a bunch of XP with certain weapon class, with, you know, all the weapon classes. And, you know what? For me... The answer is yes. Most certainly can. I'm willing to make that grind. Um, getting the 1.2 million XP for magma camo is quite the little task, though. That's been a little bit trickier, to say the least. I'll gladly take 200 XP for sliding in there, though. Basically, I just look to see when does the hard point go red, and then can I hop in there afterwards um, to pick up basically some free XP. Um, I don't know if he just got in there. I don't think he did. I didn't see it go red. But I try to pay attention to that to get an idea. Okay, there. It went red. So now, if it doesn't go blue between now and when I can get there, still... we go. There's an extra 200 XP for free. All I had to do was just run into the place I was already running towards anyways. Alright, go went red again. Oh, why wasn't I quicker on the draw there? I could have had him. Alright, level 26 with the AMR9. We're flying through these levels. Obviously shipment really helps with that, but alright. These guys are really playing the objective. I'm not playing the objective. I'm just trying to get in and get my XP for sliding in real quick. Not actually holding the hard point. They started, they changed it. Like when hard point originally came out in Black Ops 2, you only got XP for getting to the hard point. You didn't actually get any XP for holding the hard point. But they've since changed it where now every few seconds you get an extra 10 XP and 10 score. But that's just not worth the time. Um, at least not in my opinion. So I'll just... Oh, wait. Is there somebody down there? There is. Couldn't see them. So I'm just not going to go out of my way to settle into the hard point. Although the clock doesn't go down if you're sitting in the hard point. So there is some benefit to it if you're looking for a longer game. I'm really fine either way because the games tend to run about the same length regardless of how I play. Obviously, last video, if you watched... You'll see that nobody was playing the hard point at all. Um, but generally, I have, a, I have a UAV. I didn't forget this time. I forget all the time, but not this time. Hard point, the UAV is the least helpful of any of the game modes just because, like, you're already getting a. Uh, I'll use the stun, why not? Because you're already getting. You already know where they are. Well, you don't know where they are, but like you generally have a pretty good idea. You know what I mean? Like it's not hard to guess, especially on shipment. Like TDM maybe a little bit because the spawns can be kind of weird and, and wonky, but it does not really help. Uh, it's not really helping a hard point that much. You can pretty high accuracy guess where they're gonna be. 
also seem to be the only one that's even going towards the hard point. So that's really nice for XP purposes. Um, they're all behind me. Ah, we already had that. Oh, thanks, teammate. It's all right. Not like there was really anybody over there. Out there. That's a friendly. Yeah, that's a friendly. We're fine. I have no idea what I just got 100 XP for there. There are a lot of times when I'm playing and I have no idea what XP is popping up for. But I'm not mad. I've, works for me. We hit level 29 yet with this thing? Jeez. I guess we just turned level 27, so it would make sense that we still have a little bit to go before we hit level 29, obviously. We haven't gotten to level 28 yet either. It's taking us a little bit to get there. That would have been somebody affected by our tactical. So would that have. There's level 28. I just realized that we didn't have decoys. I was just throwing them at the middle of the map, not realizing that's not going to help us too much. Oh! Okay, well we should win this game. Not that that really makes too big a difference for the challenges we're trying to do. It matters if you like want to win the game or whatever, which I'm sure some of y'all, when you're playing, do you think about that? Whether it's armory unlocks or just generally wanting to win, but that's not really the thing I'm worried about. Oh, I forget. That's a stun, not a... Alright. Go ahead. Oh. I don't know why I was trying to contest that with this thing. That wasn't. Okay. Okay. We just have to get one more level, which we'll end up getting next game no problem, but I'd ideally love to get it this game real quick. Like, if I could just, like, or get most of it this last game. In these last few seconds, anyways. You should not be able to slide around with a riot shield on your back. There should be some level of, like, immobility that you experience when you're carrying around, oh, I don't know, a giant glass shield. I mean, I don't want to be Debbie Downer, but... Yeah, I kind of do. All right, fifty one and thirty nine. We played a four v four game, huh? I didn't even notice. Alright, we got to level 29, so we must have got there like right at the end or something. Um, but anyways, without further ado, I will see everybody in the next one where you will watch me try to kill enemies affected by my tactical, where I surely will not be upset by how that goes. Um, 